the West and China versus each other. When China was poor, the West pitied it, looked down on its people, and treated it with contempt as a completely irrelevant state. The Taiwan issue was not really a menace. I mean, if you think the US and its lackeys in Europe, including South Korea and Japan, care about Taiwan's 23 million people with a land mass just over three times the size of Sitka in Alaska, then you are living in the fantasy film Avatar. China is over 11,000 kilometers away from the US and over 6,000 away from Europe. It has never built military base near either of these, never invaded any, does not mingle in their internal affairs or threatens them in any way. All it does is conduct trade, try to learn from here and there, improve itself. It is now mastered the feet and makes technology seem like a ball game. They no longer look at it as irrelevant. It could even surpass them. They have now invented all kinds of fiction, throwing a China left and right. Let's see who threatens who here. In 1622 to 1624, the Dutch engaged in a series of conflicts with the Chinese. In 1839 to 1842, the British invaded China. In 1900, the eight nations attacked China. In 1931, or some would say 37, whichever you want to pick, just pick and choose, Japan invaded China. The British again occupied Hong Kong for over a century, and the Portuguese occupied Macau for centuries with an S, many, many S. The picture is beginning to clear out. These people, remember, are thousands of kilometers away. We're not done yet. According to Democracy Now! Org, the Pentagon's own account, in addition to nine military bases in the Philippines, the U.S. already has 313 military base sites in East Asia alone. The U.S. levies endless tariffs on China and imposes sanctions on China. Its lackeys in Europe follow suit. Japan and South Korea, of course, say yes to their master. Why? Because China is developing, albeit undemocratically, a non-alliance with Western hegemony. This threatens the West, basically the US, to be honest. Every other day, week, a month, these Westerners, I think we better stop saying Westerners, the US, the controller and master of these Europeans, South Korea and Japan, will have their war ships sail through proximity with China and the bad old irrelevant United Kingdom sometimes will follow suit. I think the great in Great Britain is still deceiving the UK into thinking that it is still relevant. Imagine if Chinese warships were sailing through Cuba, Venezuela and other neighboring US seas. Well, I'll let you answer that. Western countries even have policies in place designated to counter China. Imagine countries making laws to counter a nation that has never threatened them. China, with all the incursions into her land, never passes laws designed to counter any other country. Why are these people so threatened? by China's growth. Let's look at how many countries China has invaded, sanctioned or interfered in their internal affairs. Take a guess, please. Zero. China is involved in construction and urban reshaping of almost every country in Africa. It has built roads the length of the entire European Union twice traffic light, trains, all kinds of buildings, factories, you name it. Infrastructure at a fraction of the price Europeans will charge. Sometimes China will even lend up loans at extremely low flexible interest rates. Now, this will surprise you. China even does some for absolutely free. 
China does the same in Asia and South American countries, building and co-working with those countries on an equal basis. China does not tell you what to do. It does not interfere in your affairs. It just wants to trade. What is so wrong about this China? Is China perfect? Hell no. But is China better between the West and China? Absolutely. China is a better guy. The same set of countries that pillaged the whole world now wants to pretend to be the engines, the upholders of human rights. No. Those of us who actually read say no. What do you think? Do you agree with this? Feel free to drop your comments in the comment section and don't forget to subscribe and hit the like notification button for more videos like these.